करेगी Welcome to Scanny TV or YouTube once again. Let's see some latest updates coming in from the camp of Black Stars team and some other latest updates you need to know on this channel. The breaking news is that the English national team, the Three Lions, they are ready to hand a call up to the 18 year old boy who plays for Manchester United. That is Kobe Menu. Yes, I spoke about the player in the last video and I said that I don't think um, the player might play for Ghana, but. Many of you are saying I should be hopeful, so I'm also going to be hopeful. But right now, the latest update is they want to call him the FA, Ghana Football Association. They are also now trying to make contact with the player. And it is really interesting. We check out that latest write-up and everything in this video. We also talk about the Black Stars Management Committee. They are yet to actually form the one after the election, um, the last time around. So, we also talk about it. Sami Kufo, then Steven Apia. Per, um, you know, reports going on per rumors, the two were invited to join the management committee, but they have declined that particular call. We will check it out in this video. Then we will also take some latest updates coming in on Ransford or say if you can recall, he was a fantastic striker. To be honest with you, at a point in time, he was the bronze medalist in the under 17 tournament World Cup, FIFA World Cup in 2007, and he's come out to accuse one Ghana a football association school member that he asked him for bribe. He took bribe from him so that the player will be maintained in the black stars team it is really interesting we will check out all those audios interviews which has been done i'll play it for you to enjoy it in this update and some latest updates that i'll talk about them in this video coach chris Hitting, should he go or should he remain um we have one former um you know german international he has spoken about him then one Ghanaian has also um said that we should sack the coach well it's going to be interesting this update i really like it you know before then kindly like the video for me after that if you are new subscribe to this channel put us on post notifications so that anytime you drop a latest update you'll be the first person to get and also enjoy leave your thoughts and comments in the comment box i'll try and give shout out to all those who commented under the last video as of the time i'm making this one so please leave your comments it's very necessary like the video for me i appreciate you like let's get about 100 150 i appreciate you so much this video is also brought to you in collaboration with pay and your money transfer where are you based in Europe? Europe or Canada, anywhere in Europe or Canada, um, whether you are based in Denmark, Spain, Italy, anywhere in Europe and you want to send money to someone in Ghana here or Africa, I will pin the link in the comment box as well as the video description. Click on it and sign up for yourself. If you use Oskeni as your referral, you will be given a bonus on your first transaction you make on the platform. And anytime you send money, it is also free of charge. We've been in the system for about 10 years. So if you want to send money to someone in Africa here, SMAS is coming. So sign up right now and enjoy the better service from Pay Angel Money Transfer. We are there for you at your service. Register and bring me a good feedback. Now, let me begin from here before we talk about the bribe allegations. Then, um, you know, Kobe Menu and others. Let's begin from here. And before then, let me also say a big congratulations going out to Evelyn Bedu, she is the Ghana Black Queens player. Yes, currently she plays for Avadness in Sweden. She's won one player's player of the year and best player of the season in Sweden side Avadness. Very, very fantastic lady and we wish her all the best. She'll be joining the Black Queens to play the last qualifiers for the WAFCON, which will happen next year. So we wish her all the best. Congratulations going out to you, Evelyn Bedu. Now, let me begin from here. Um, Coach Chris Hitton, after his performances for the Black Stars team, we all know and uh, most of us are not happy with the performance because if you want to go to World Cup 2026, we cannot lose that way to Comoros. And we all the first half, we are not playing well. I've been speaking about all these things, so I don't want to go back to them. Now, Gerard Asamoah, um, he is of Ghanaian descent, but he decided to play for the German national team. And about last week, he brought about 50 doctors from Germany to Ghana here to operate um, case or um, you know, children with holy hearts in Ghana. He is doing a great job, and we say God bless him on that front. Now, he was interviewed by Joy Sports on Coach Chris and whether we should maintain him or sack him. He says that we should maintain him, and in fact, try to maintain the coach for a longer period. Let's check out this short video. After that, we will take out the interesting updates. I think uh, what we need is like con continuously somebody who will be long there to know, okay, hey, we have a project, let me say five years, and this, uh, this is a coach where we are going to. But what Ghana, what we have is like, Otto came out, I don't know how Otto, how long Otto Ado say, so no, no, not even a year, he left. Also so it's like to have a coach to believe in him to say, okay, hey, we have a project with you, maybe in five in five years we want to be there. 
So then you need to believe the coach to, to work with the coach. So this is what I can say to the members. So maybe it will be an idea to keep along on the coach. Oh yes, so that is it from um, Gerard Asamoah, the former um, German international. Now, still on coach Chris Sutton, Neil Armstrong Motabi, the former managing director for Accra of Folk. He is a Ghanaian. He says that the coach should be sacked because he has not added anything to the current Black Star squad going forward. So yes, we should sack him. When he was speaking with Graphic Sports X Spaces, this is what he said. It becomes difficult to see where Mr. Hilton is taking the team. And this is not limited to the last two games. Um, then he also continues to say, I struggle to see a philosophy. I struggle to see us using our players in roles where I think the players could apply themselves better. If I were a member of the Ghana Football Association Executive Council, I would be moving that we con contemplate a coaching change. So according to him, he will actually be moving that, yes, let's try to decide to bring in a new coach at this particular time because Chris Sitting is not really doing any better than the world. So that is it. Do you think Coach Chris Sitting should be sacked or he should be maintained? As the black stars could um, you know head coach going forward let me know your thoughts in the comments box now black stars former players sammy kufo and steven tornado appear according to modernghana.com and um the story was written by samuel echo amosi appear one of the renowned writers in ghana here he says that sammy kufo and steven appear and um, they have turned down management committee appointments for the black stars team it is really interesting reading the story he says that yes there has been a report that they have been offered a chance to serve on the black stars management committee and both of them they have turned down the office it's really interesting we know sami kufo already he played for the black stars he went to the world cup 2006 with us and he was really fantastic then steven appear at tornado we all know him um you know one fantastic captain for the national team they've all served in that particular um you know row before or that that particular management committee member um you know row before but this time around um pair his write up both have turned down the offer and i'll be following and bring you up to speed updates on that talking about kobe menu yes um i brought you an update in the last video according to the latest reports the english national team the three lions coach gary southgate he want to offer the player you know call up to join the team because he's just heard that Ghanaians are really calling for the fa to make sure they talk with him and pair other checks the fa they are now contacting the player in fact i spoke about this player 2022 Yes, around May 2022. So just check it. Over a year now, I said that this player was really fantastic. Let's get him, even if not into the Blast Stars team, get him into maybe the Anatoly and Fred. Try to, you know, let the player know that you really like him and you want him to play for the national team. And anytime some of us we, we talk, sometimes they do take it, other times too, they just ignore it. So that is it. Now, according to a write up on Daily Star Sports, um, this is what they have to say. And I'm just bringing you shots of that particular write up. Manchester United's Kobe Menu at center of international fight for um, England and Gary Southgate. Exclusive Manchester United latest academy sensation um, Kobe Menu impressed in his full Premier League debut as England boss Gary Southgate keeps a close eye on the midfielder. They continue to say Gary Southgate will target Manchester United's talent Kobe Menu in a bid to keep him out of the clutches of Ghana. Menu has represented England at under 17, under 18, and under 19 level, but is still eligible for Ghana through his parents. But Salgate is desperate to see him pledge his international future to the Three Lions instead. So according to them, right now the coach is really looking for it to call the player to join the Three Lions national team so that he will actually keep him away from um, the player coming to play for Ghana. We all know the player. He has Ghanaian parents, also sisters and brothers who are all Ghanaians. And there is that probability that a player might come and play for us. But the big question is, will he come? Well, I will actually have the hope that the player will come and play for Ghana because he's really fantastic. In fact, if you really follow the boy, um, I, as I spoke about him in 2022, he is an offensive midfielder. He plays in the more number 10 role, sometimes number 8, but he does very well in the number 10 role. But, um, you know, recently under Eric Ten Hag, he plays him as the defensive midfielder or the number 6. So he's really versatile. He can play number 6, number 8, number 10. Really, really fantastic boy. Just 18 years of age and he can still play for Ghana. So, Ghana Football Association, if you want to go in for the boy, push harder because right now, English national team, they want to call the boy and that is it. Now, let me climax everything on this particular, um, we will say allegations because um, one 
party has said his part and we'll wait for the other one. That is talking of Ransford or say he was a fantastic striker. I know definitely you know him if you actually enjoy the Ghana um, under 17, 2007 and also under 20 in 2009 winning or conquering the whole world, winning under 20 FIFA World Cup and they were really fantastic Ransford or say. Then, um, you know, Sadiq Adam just mentioned all those players. He was really fantastic. And the player has spoken. He says that one ESCO member that is Mr. Frederick, a champion, Fred Achi, that we call him. He actually asked him to pay bribe at around that time in order to keep his um, spot in the Black Stars team because at that time he was very young and he heard that the player has earned a collab. It's really interesting. He spoke with Talk Royal Radio and um, we saw some excerpts of that particular interview which was posted by one um, journalist in Ghana here. He works with um, ABN, that is Angel TV and also Angel Radio in Accra, that is talking of Listo Wall. Listo Wall actually posted this part and this was the first post then we will listen to that interview and we will take the second one as well and um this is the first one he said that Gunners ran for the say who won bronze in 2007 and the 17 World Cup he was told to pay bribes to get and keep his place in the black stars by corrupt mafias who were close to the power at that time he has named achi as the one who took his money but they didn't pay for him to keep his place then he also went on to make this post then we check out that interview as a journalist getting info that the innocent striker had um, had a call he called him and took credit for it and because he is corrupt, he told Osei to give him money so he can pay bribes to keep his place because that is what others do to keep their place. He scammed the boy. So let's check out that first part of the interview where he said that um, he called him that he should pay amount of money in order to keep his place. After that, we will talk more. $20,000. I said, I'm catch up for I said, I'm going to catch up for So I don't really... Uh, so what I say? So it was just an appreciation. Oh, you are listening to bribe, but talk radio. Mama, say, "Umma, me say, I can't believe me. Come across me, me and Kiki walk around. Me, but me just can't. Enti no, we we na me say, me damn wasi. Now we watch me and him. Afresi kanu, afresi kanu anko. Me ma me catch me say, "Wasu da ena ko we afresi kanu anko." Na me say, "Da bi achi don't me say." Achi ko bi do me achi fati bi. Don't me me say. Um, I went back to FC20. To and then 2010, South Africa uh, uh, to, uh, woke up, called up Sinabaya. No. I'm in him. I'm a far from friends. Ah, Achi. I didn't know. The friend is saying. The uh, squad with me. Also, Randy Mose, I am a young player, you know, half more years ahead of me. I am a young player, I am a good chance. <laughs> that means I am a slot, you know. And then, I am a young player, I am a young player. All because, eh, he just drop you. All right, yes. So that is it from Ransford. I say now let's continue and take the last part. Ransford says said after giving Achi his share and huge bribe to be given to the other top officials, he didn't send the money, which cost him World Cup 2020-10. It is really interesting. Let's check out the last part. After that, I'll give the shout out and we'll bring everything to an end. We have a body natural. I can't remember that day now. I tell you, Emma is I can now. You could just happen or the man. Aye. Aye. Ewa Ewa Christ posted him. Yeah, I'm the guy. But when I'm in Yako, Nipa from a friend of the champo. My money no sport media actually. Oh, okay, okay. Ah. Uh... No friend. No friend, no. Oh, that's what we're here for. I'm so we're crying. We'll be president of Canada. I'm so okay. I'm not catching him. Say, run the best friend this year. Run away from now. Come on, say this in Lagos now. Blasters now. Oma from the camp. Now my passport on me. James own passport to come and see. That's okay. And off from here, Oma ma kaji visa. That day I was with me kaji visa a few. Man, come and see kaji visa. And I don't know. We caught just the few South Africa and visit. I'm kaji visa. Not even know South Africa. Now we go. What I say? It's no. If I know tournament, you know maybe I can't go. Oh. Uh, if anything, on the blasters, the 
see in a cost war. You'll be sure appreciate this to her, then you have to also pay it back. I'm so when they said any problem to me, I'm on Pyramid Court Tournament. Doc Royal, so I'm Court Tournament, but I'm not going to see the second. Scarback, I cry fine. And I'm about to buy a fee. Doc Royal, and then I be through Ghana as a coach at a president in Ghana. You want to frame us, ah, chief, for the champ away. But from your hands, I know where you mom. I'm so senior. I know what to do. Me senior, no, me no, I'm a free man. I'm 17. Uh, baby, I'm a customer. First contract is where Maccabi high five. Me no, the core because now that I'm aging, I'm 17. Now, me a minor tuna. I'm a one of my Oh, Man City, Man City, I'm a knuckle. What the five star would take? No, Chile. I'm so on Pukla. I won't be Tompi. I'm in a bit. I'll be a bit. I'll be a bit. I'll be a bit. I'll be Oh yes, so that is it coming in from Ransford or say the former player. In fact, he retired early due to reoccurring injuries, and that is it. Now we are waiting for the response from um Fred Achi, the man whose name has been mentioned that he took bribes around that time. We'll be waiting to see if re response comes or anything. I'll bring it to you on this channel. Let me give an amazing shout out to you guys before I take you off. Your shout out going out to Foster Body. I appreciate you so much for always being here. You commented under the last video. Imanu Amani, I've also seen you are doing great. Levinston, Elena Mamenuku, I appreciate you a lot. Joseph Ugomabu, thank you for being here. I appreciate you. Elijah Nana Sante is also here. So other questions, I've also seen you. Elijah Nana Sante, thank you. Fenton Daniel, I've also seen you. You are doing great. Then I have Joshua Labi. Thank you for being here, Joshua. Ima 8485. I appreciate you a lot. Then I also have Blue View Capital. Thank you. Juma Samson is also on this channel. Max Doc, you are also here. Thank you, Max Doc. Um, then the next one, I have Steve Notice. You are also on this channel. Ernest, I met a few. Thank you. Steve Notice. Okay, thank you. I appreciate you. Samson Kudaho is also on this channel. I appreciate you a lot. Samson. Dambi Chris is also on this channel. It's all about Ghana TV. It's all about Ghana TV. You say you've never heard your name today. I've mentioned it. Thank you for being here. Teach them. You are also here. Thank you. Something could have, I think I've mentioned already. Amura Jonas, bro, and Kwame Edu Jenfi watching me from the United States of America. Let me know your thoughts in the comments box. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, put on the bell for more updates here on this channel. This was Kelly TV, and of course, we shall meet later.